How would you feel about staff members carrying concealed weapons on your kids' school campus? That's the idea on the table at Greeley's Frontier Academy Charter School as a way to deter school violence and cut down on costs. 7 News reporter Russell Haythorn is live at the school now, and Russell, parents definitely divided on this issue. And the principal says they are certainly getting mixed reactions. The proposal could save the school hundreds of thousands a year in security costs, but it is not without controversy. If the proposal is accepted, the halls inside Frontier Academy would not only include lockers, bags and books, but also armed staffers. Obviously, it's a controversial issue, so there's people very passionate about both sides of the issue. Frontier Academy principal Dr. Steven Seedorf says to be clear, the proposal does not include teachers, only non-teaching staff. Because we don't want this person to have to respond to a threat and then leave a classroom full of students unattended. Outside the school, no shortage of opinions amongst parents. Anything to deter campus violence. Why well, see both sides. I see how they desire to want to take care of our children, to protect them. In general, if someone wants to get into the schools, they're going to get in there. Um, I think in the right hands, it's a good idea. All the help we can get, it's better for those kids. Seedorf says the proposal is an inexpensive alternative to paying a school resource officer or security firm. It's just a policy that says if there's someone here at the school that meets this criteria and these specific and high standards of training qualifications, we would allow them to carry a concealed weapon on campus. Seedorf says realistically there would only be one to two staff members who qualify at any given time here at the middle school, high school, and then one to two staff members who qualify at any given time over at the elementary school. Surveys will be emailed to parents next week. This will likely not be implemented until March, if at all. Live in Greeley, Russell Haythorn, 7 News.